Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Let's go. What the heck? What? What was that, dude? I don't know what you're talking about. Those elevators are tight. Wow. Oh, hey. I don't have to reverse on this. Go ahead. Checking out? Yes. Okay, thank you. Do you work all night? All night? Work? Here? Yes. Oh, yeah? yeah. You work all night? <laughs> <laughs> Say thank you. Oh, no. It's really hot. I think I was literally here last night at 1 a.m. Yeah, my gosh. We're out in Kochi. It's time to shine. This water is, feels so much colder now that the air is so much is so hot our first goal of the day is to get some indian south indian style breakfast here we have a little restaurant we're gonna go to that we actually walked by the other day it was open we last night it's open 24 hours the reviews are decent some of them are like wow it's really good south indian food and some are like it's the worst food i've ever had <laughs> in my life you never know you never know let's go Yeah. Review uh, Yeah. Review Yes, you too. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah, what should we get here? What should we eat? What should we eat? <laughs> uh, best seller. What's the best? Best seller? I'll just go. Okay. Okay. What the, I guess we have to get the, some of the, the donuts. The vada? Yeah. And then the... Like the masala dosa, is right? This a, is this banana? It, is this banana? Uh, banana spray. Banana? Oh. Okay. Yeah, let's try a bunch of this stuff, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, can we get banana? One banana. The, the vada. Or the... <laughs> I guess. Photo, photo, yeah. <laughs> Let's try it. Banana fritter. Hi. All right. That's good. Thank you. You want to try the vada? Is this? Uh, do you eat this with curry? Oh, yes. oh okay. Sauce. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is it spicy? Yeah, spicy. Spicy, <laughs> okay. Hmm. What? This is channel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, YouTube channel. YouTube, mm -hmm. uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Oh. So it's kind of like a sweet and sour sauce. And oh, shoot, we'll move over. That's very good, nice soft bread, nice and oily. Salty bread, or is it? No, not salty. And then the, it's like a sweet, it kind of reminds me of sambal sauce a bit from Indonesia. Uh -huh. Very, very delicious. Nice. Interesting. Uh, anything else we want? Yeah, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs> Here? Yeah. <laughs> uh, how much? How much? 24. 24? Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Oh gosh. Very delicious little start. Oh, this is yummy. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Ice cream parlor. Oh. Oh, is this this might be the actual restaurant. We just went to the coffee shop. Oh. So we just got a taste, baby. Holy nuts, my back is sweaty. <laughs> We've been outside for 10 minutes. It's very hot. All right, we're going in. He's for two, can we sit? Thank you. Oh, what's the best seller? 
most popular one. I want like the masala. The masala? Okay. Yeah, we'll do one of those. And then, do you want to forget anything else? Um, Rava dosa, Rava masala. Dosa. Okay, and one of those. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, we got a nice little snacker heading into here. And now it's time for the meal, our breakfast meal. We got some dosa. It's gonna be interesting to see how this is. We got de roast dosa and then rava masala dosa. Those are the two we recommended. Oh, we good. Oh, baby. Look at that. That is some delicious looking food. We lived in India for a month, but we never got dosa. No, we didn't. So we got three different. Oh, yours is there, okay. No. We just got three different things and then like a, a more saucy one. We'll see. Look at how massive this rack and thing is. It's like a pyramid. Nice and flaky. Listen to this ASMR, guys. All right, we're starting a new TikTok channel. ASMR foods on our travels. Oh, whoa, it's really soft on the inside. It's like, a, like when you make a pancake, like the bottom of it's kind of that doughy softness. Now I'll just start with the green one. Mmm, that is so good. Spicy. The one I thought would be the least spicy is spicy. <laughs> but just, I miss those flavors. It just immediately hits you. All of the different spices. Mmm, that is so, so good. Now I'll try this white one. I'm not, I'm not even sure what this is. Uh, it's, maybe it's mashed up paneer. Oh, it might be. It kind of looks like it would be like a cottage cheese. Yeah. Mm. I think there's some yogurt in there. Uh, a bit more sour. Luckily, not spicy at all. It'll actually cool the spice for me. That's delicious. That's your combo. Zoink, 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 zoink. The actual dosa itself tastes so good. And yours is ghee, and mine is masala. Does yours have like the omelet inside of it? Or not omelet, I guess, but whatever the heck is inside of it. Oh wait, yeah, there is some. Oh, it's hot. I got the stuff inside right here too. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Oh no, the spice. Huh? The spice. Is it hot and spicy? It's pretty spicy. This is hot. I'm gonna just try it straight up. Wow. It's potato. It's just like mashed potato. Mm. It's super, super good. Super good. That's like top tier mashed potato. They're spicy. Ooh. Not super spicy, it's like a good spice, but spicy a it, bit. The weird thing is it kind of grows in the background. Remember, that was the India spice, it always just grows. So let me try the orange sauce. I'm eating with my left hand. Mm. Oh, that one's really spicy. What is? The orange one. Oh no. This one seems like the one that they have the spoon for, that you like pour it on, but I'm just gonna dip it. Cause I'm a straight mad lad like that. Wow, that one's more tomatoey. So, less to my preference, but it's actually still really tasty. I really like this spice one, and I really, really, really love the potato inside of this. It's like super good. It's like alu jira kind of, like potatoes mashed inside of a dosa. And the dosa itself, that's top tier bread. I know a lot it's of people, so good. a lot of people say dosa is their favorite bread, like better than naan and paratha and stuff, and that's pretty close. We couldn't have believed that because we love our thick doughy bread. Yeah. But this, even though it looks so thin, it is also doughy on the inside. That's super, super good. Yum. Ah, wow, that was some extremely delicious food. I mean, we devoured that thing. So good. I wonder what the difference was between ours. Like the taste of the actual dough. Yeah, I don't know. We have no idea. We could have tried each other's, I guess. It was so delicious. I that thing was gone instantaneously. It's been a while since we've had this. When we first came to India, this was super sweet. But now that we've lived in the Philippines and we've gotten used to like sweet tropical fruit juices, it's very similar to Philippines juices. Uh, like uh, the sweetness, so it's really good. I remember we loved that thing though, Maza. All right, we paid, it was 265 for the two dozas and my drink. I don't know if the water was charged too. Let's see, ah, it's not there. I don't know if you tip in India. I don't know either, but why not? Why not, what should we give? It's 20, just two, I can just go, pop. Why not? There you go. 
I know, guys, we're showing this on film because we're really nice people. Yeah, I mean, you can't tip if you don't show it on film. Yeah, come on. Look at the massive bags that load it up. Oh, great, now I have two things to carry. Oh, thank you. Back out into the heat. Dun, dun, dun. <sighs> My gosh, but I mean, that food, so good. Just our first taste of South Indian Kerala food. We're back in fracking India, baby. Ooh. The food's delish. Well, let's get an Uber. We gotta go into the city. That was a long Uber drive, like over an hour. Uh, but we're here now, to our hotel. The Coral Isle. <gasps> Let's go in. Heck yeah. Hello. Are we doing a reservation? Me? Tyler Hollister? Can I have the passport, please? Yes. I feel like I'm in a magical wonderland. Amazing. Doors opening, serious. Oh, this is pretty nice. This room was $33. So, I mean, it was $16 more expensive than our last one, but it's already looking quite a bit nicer. I went too far. What are we? Four? Oh. Five? No, six, right here. Oh. <laughs> here we go. Oh, it's one bed. Ah. That is. The pictures showed a lot of different things. So we didn't know if it was one bed or two beds or one small bed, one big bed, or what, but it's one bed. Looks pretty solid. It's humid as nuts in here. What the heck is it? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Well, the AC has been activated. We have a freaking fridge, bro. You can put your maza in there, bro. And my favorite type of water, Aquafina. It's veg, don't worry. Veg, Aquafina? Veg water. Nice. Well, at least it's a big bed. If it was a double bed, we may have problems. What do you mean? That's not a problem. Oh. Oh. Ah. Uh -huh. We have a fracking seat. Oh. Do you feel fancy? That's $33 a night right there. I mean, it's probably at least three of the dollars to go to say, this. I would say. I bet the room that was slightly cheaper didn't have that chair. No, and now we have a chair. Not only that, but we also... <laughs> Sorry, not as cool as in Guangzhou where you had the nice view behind you. Uh, are you sure about that? Ah, 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 ah. I can't fully turn around. Ah, ah, ah. It looks a lot warmer than Guangzhou. A lot warmer. Guangzhou is cold as nuts. Let's check out the fracking bathroom. Wow, the shower has a door. Isn't that nice? Oh, it's a it's a tubular shower head. Mm. I think you're supposed to. That's really good for cleaning your insides, right? Because you. You can hold it. Let's see if it's hot, ready? Ooh, it has hot water. Yesterday we did not. So, uh, water pressure test. It does. What the fuck? <gasps> it's out there still up there? What the <laughs> Where the heck did that thing come from? <laughs> Secret. There's a sh up above shower too, that's sick. Shoot, how the heck do I turn this off now? You did not think too far ahead. Oh yeah, watch your dang socks. Bidet test. 
that's these. And you can talk to your friends while you're duking. Sure, that feels good in this heat. Need to dry off the sweat. The switch doesn't do anything, but it, it's, a, it's a nice little mirror. Wait, it's not zoomed in on the camera. That's our room. That's a wow. We got a lot cooler out here after being in that hot room. That's what you can get for $33 right in downtown Kochi. Pretty nice. Uh, Would have been nice if there were two beds, but there's not. So uh, this is what we get. How cool is that? Bed dust. Firm. Pretty similar to last one, but a little bit more firm. Look at this fracking thing. It's the star of iniquity. All beautiful things must be destroyed. Oh. But. See, this is just a little life lesson for all of you, because beauty is in the eye of the beholder, and when beauty is destroyed... That's super uggo. It can be replaced. By what? All I know with is, swagger. As I see this. Welcome everybody to the streets. We're gonna be uh, heading down MG Road. Does that sound familiar, MG Road? Because we went to Bangalore and they have a very famous MG road there. Is the one in Kochi as famous? I don't think so. It doesn't seem to be like as much of a tourist spot as the one in Bangalore was, but we're gonna walk down it and see what the heck is down there. Maybe find some food, probably find a lot of very busy streets. The train station is right behind us. Our hotel is like basically right next to it. So that'll be very convenient for when we move on to the next city and we head south into Kerala or continuing south into Kerala. I really forgot how toasty it gets here. Seems like we're in an area of a lot of uh, hotels and condos and stuff. We're, we're hoping it'd be a little more of like a local street, but it's actually super, super busy. I guess the train station. These streets are actually pretty dang clean. Yeah, they are. The whole drive from up by the airport to like downtown Kochi here, I was pretty surprised with how there really wasn't like too much pollution on the street. And it's interesting also on the drive to see how many shops or how many places are like this on the left here where it's like studying abroad and like UAE visa stuff. Cause we know a lot of the Indians in Dubai are from Kerala. When we were driving in the, uh, Uber, which was about an hour, a little longer than an hour actually, because there was some traffic. I saw one of those things and it had all the different flags and one of the flags was Georgia. Really? Yeah, because we met some Indians when we were in Georgia by the medical school. And it's just interesting. You wouldn't think with how small of a country Georgia is that that would be like advertised. The Papali house. We don't have a sidewalk, we just kind of have a patch of dirt. National Urban Livelihoods Mission Welfare Center is some sort of government building. There was some like town halls earlier that I thought earlier that looked really cool. And there's just a flower thing right there. There's a bakery. There's a lot of bakeries here actually too. I've seen quite a few. Seems like we would just walk through like a really nice neighborhood. Yeah, I mean, there was two really nice condos in the area, so we must have. A nice neighborhood, but it doesn't have much walking ability. Everybody must just have cars. Hey, look at this. Very clean and green. The last time we were in India, we went to the city of Bangalore, which is a very, very, very large city, but it's definitely not even close to as clean as Kochi has been so far. Oh gosh, don't get hit by a tanker bus. It'd definitely be squooshered and dead. Crossing the road in India. Once again, is never an easy feat. Do you, does this remind you of standing in the middle in Mangalore? Oh gosh, I think they can still turn. Huh. Probably be slightly better to be on that side too. Get the watch it here. Oh yeah. Don't drink and drive it, go slow. That's a good idea. We good? Are we good? Hello. Hi, how are you? 
All right, Fort Kochi, 13 kilometers straight ahead. We're walking the whole way there. I'm ready already. We just walked down this street. There should be a lot of restaurants. I mean, look at this. Juice, tea, snacks. Look at the juice. They got lassi. Oh, they got lassi. They got everything, bro. I've never seen orange lassi before. No, yeah. Just get buttermilk. Oh. Hi. Hello. Um, I'll try some... I'll do an orange lassi, please. Orange lassi. <laughs> yeah. Just one, yeah. Yeah. And no ice, is it? Nice. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. okay. Yeah. How much is it? Uh, US. US. America. Are you a Yeah, 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 we're a vlogger. <laughs> How's it going? You ready for an orange Alasi? Some fresh fruit juices. Uh, juice, just fruits. Heck yeah. It'd be very delicious. First Alasi back in India. Yep. Uh, from America, the oh, US. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's our first day here. So far, it seems really nice. Yeah. What? What's a good place to go in Kochi? Sorry? West Bengal. West Bengal? Uh, okay. Where's that? Yeah. Where? Is it? Yeah. What area? Uh, no. <laughs> okay. What? The channel name here. I'll, uh, I have. Wow! Look at us. I have a card. Or not. Where is it? The card. It's in my wallet too. Are you guys all from Kochi? Yeah. You guys from Kochi? Huh. Blending up the lofty now. Yummy. We got a lot of different. Yeah, look at all that. What is this thing? It looks like a giant Lenzone. It does. That's what I thought too when I saw it. <laughs> what? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Traffic lifestyle. Yeah. <laughs> that's where. That's our vlog channel. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so there's a restaurant here too. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's cool. Is it South Indian food or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. nice. All right, perfect. There it is. Perfect, thank you. How much is it? 50. 50? Some orange lassi. Look at this. Doesn't look orange. No, it's, it's, this is clickbait. Thank you. Mm. Wow, the sweetness of lassi hitting my mouth again. That is so good. The orange flavor is just like a nice little citrus. It kind of just tastes like mango lassi, but a little more citrusy. Oh, it's so good. I'm going to devour this quick. It doesn't taste like Minute Maid. All right, you got to do Dale Phillip. That thing, thing should be gone in All right. 30 seconds. Oh, you need two hands for it. You're going to have a stomach ache. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, very good. Thank you so much, guys. You're very good. <laughs> It's nice to meet you guys. Oh, thank you. Have a good day. Wow, it was so good. He drank it in 10 seconds. <laughs> the guy behind was like. <laughs> <laughs> it did taste really good. So good, you just couldn't stop. It had to be inhaled. I miss it. It wasn't as thick as typical ones we've gotten before. But that made it so much easier to down. We've never seen lassi made in front of us. So they were putting like a powder in it. So I don't know if it's mm -hmm. like kind of like uh, milk tea in Southeast Asia where there's powdered milk tea and then there's other non-powdered equivalents. I don't know. How authentic was that? Let us know in the comms. I don't think we're officially to MG Road yet, but this is a lot different looking than MG Road in Bangalore. Oh yeah. The, it's above us we got the Metro, the Kerala Metro, the Kochi Metro. It seems like it's just kind of like one line yeah. down this big road here. Supposed to be apparently one of the most modern metros in India, so we'll be trying that later on, seeing if it can stack up against some of the some of the better metros we've gone on in Asia. It probably won't take much to beat the old New York subway, though. Nah, but 
And my, it would take a lot to beat the East Asian, uh, <laughs> Korea, Japan, China. We were just in China, so, uh, you know, it's gonna, have, it's gonna be a hard one to beat that, but we'll see, we'll see. Oh my gosh. What? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, here's the other metro station. So we made it to the MG Road metro station. Okay. Up. I know there's a mall up here too, so we might peek on that one, even though it's not the big modern Lulu mall that this place is known for. Well, this thing's getting scary. <laughs> Shoot, we got some wind action. Wind time, muffs equipped. Time to equip our dead mouse. Dead cat. This is very intimate. This is what it would feel like if you were an actor. And then here, I love wow. I gotta do your makeup too. All right, everybody, reporting from the MG Road in Kochi, I'm bringing you the news. Uh, today's news, the uh, hand people are doing something. Then the, there's some communist things over there too. Yeah, there's a hammer and sickle all, all over the place. I don't know what that's about. Is there a communist, a communist, is there a communist uprising here in Kerala? Uh, maybe. We don't comment on any politics, so don't. We were just, uh, we just noticed that. Just observing that there's a lot of hammer and sickles. A helicopter flying over by. Whoa. Wow. Hello. Oh, what is this? Shawarma pocket. Shawarma can take? And chicken roll. Chicken roll, okay. Chicken cutlet, chicken sabosa. Uh, can I try it? Chicken roll? Per piece. Per piece? How much? 25. Okay. Yeah. Do you want one? Sure. Um, or do you want to try a shawarma cake? Or I'll something? try. I'll try one of those. Yeah. And I'll do one roll. Yeah. Take away. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. Take, take away. away. Really? A possible. Double juice. Ah, uh, no. I just drank some. Do you want any? I have water. water. All right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, the U.S. U.S. Yeah. Where's the here? Where, where uh, we're staying up the road, kind of by the... The train station? Yeah. Ah. That shawarma, just dripping with all the... Oh, yum, look at that. Oil. Indian shawarma was good when we got it yeah. in Bangalore. Empire restaurant. Look at that. Uh, here you go. Oh, look at that thing. We have a lot of interesting more banana fritters. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. A chicken roll and a shawarma cake. That is so interesting. Shawarma cake, I've never heard of that before. I got a chicken roll because a different vlogger said how much he loves rolls in India. So I got a chicken roll, why not? Time to roll up some chicken. This one seemed to be deep fried too, which is interesting. Hey, what a better place than right here. Wow. All right, your shawarma cake's on the top there, pal. Shawarma cake! Oh my gosh. I don't even know what's in there, but there's a frack ton of stuff. And a frack and chicken roll? It smells sweet. Really? Yeah, it's done. Whoa. Wow. Whoa. Wow. Just oozing with spices and juicy chicken wow mine is kind of like a a soft samosa uh, with chicken the amount of flavor in this is immaculate it's a little too dry if it was a little wetter like if that was right if this was fresh it'd probably be much better luckily they had a nice covering a plastic covering mm -hmm. over all the items so no foreign invaders could come and take it well as you saw, the camera died there, but that was pretty good. Finished up our delicious rolls. The bread part of it was a bit sweet. Yeah, mine was a bit sweet too. I don't know what it was. It was like a, it was like the thickness of a tortilla around the outside. There's just so many juice shops. Yeah. Oh, look at these. They have the uh, like pita shawarma wrapping sitting around. Samosas. Hi. Hey. Seems like. Uh, 
Arabic food is very popular here. Yeah, like it is. Arabian Peninsula. There's putu. We've kind of looked up online what foods we're supposed to get here, so we're gonna try to check a bunch off the list. And uh, we just found it. Yep, the best one. Wow. <laughs> I feel like that literally happens in every country we go to. We're talking about food that we're supposed to get and McDonald's pops up. <laughs> it always does. This series will have a lot of stories from our old uh, vlog. So if you want to know all about that, go check out our old vlog series in Karnataka. We got a full playlist of it. You can just go to our India vlogs playlist. The last time we were in Mangalore, we actually had a hotel that was right across the street from a McDonald's. So we, we dabbled in it. And by dabbled, he means that we ate as much things as we possibly could. <laughs> but uh, that video turned out a little low quality, so it might be something that we reintroduce because we did not have the lighting or the uh, good equipment for that type of video. We didn't even post it on this channel. Nope. Oh, hey, we just walked out of here. Welcome to Kochi. What a view. We're now in the Center Square Mall. I don't know how much you guys saw of the last uh, bit between the chicken roll and coming to this mall. Uh, our mic got messed up a bit, so I don't know how much you guys saw of that. We'll see, but we're in the mall now. It's a really nice mall. It's similar to the, I don't know, what was that one called? So well, the big one in Mangalore, I don't remember. Yeah. I feel like it was Center something yeah, too. Yeah, it might've been Central, Center. Uh, it's very, it's similar to that, but I feel like it's a newer one because it's slightly fancier. Wow, that metro is quiet. It's quieter than the street. That's crazy. It must be a really nice new metro. It'd be nice if they expanded it into more areas of the city. But yeah, we're here. There's a, there's a really big food court in this mall and a Buster's most importantly. Dave and Buster's. No, just Buster's with oh. a Z. He left Dave behind. He went on his own business venture into India. Yeah, Buster was like, Dave, I'm going to India. And he's like, what, why? Because I, I want a Buster's with a Z. And Dave's like, what about me? You're not part of this game anymore, Dave. You've been holding me back. And I'm rebranding myself, putting a Z at the end. Oh yeah. We'll show you Buster's later. <laughs> oh, I like the shape of this green building. It's like geometric and pointy. Hey, and they did it without like losing space because it's still the same shape. They just like twisted it up a bit. Yeah. That the is twistoid objecto. It's like a Rubik's cube when you like twist them all like off yeah, a bit. Yeah, and you just kind of leave it there. Yeah. So the math adds up. You don't lose any space from just a square building. Exactly. All right, let's, let's go in there. Oh, they're opening another Taco Bell. Oh, jeez. See this mall? Very large. There's a lot of options up in the food court. A lot of fast food stuff. Chick King, your favorite restaurant of them all. Gonna rent a Mercedes. All right, get in now. We were thinking of getting like biryani or something like that, but we figured probably biryani would be something we'd probably get at an actual restaurant and it'd be better than at a food court stall. You think? So instead we're gonna be getting Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut, Pizza, Pizza Hut. Kraken Busters. It's with two T's too. Hi. Hi. Here, call this over. Oh, now they're, they're running. <laughs> How's, How's it going? going? <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> huh? Oh, you're a YouTuber? YouTuber? What's the channel? Right, shout out. What's your channel? <laughs> yeah, uh, try fate. Is this your shop? Uh, oh. There, there we go. You go. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you guys. <laughs> try fate lifestyle. I know. It's a it's a it's a lifestyle. A try fate lifestyle. It's just a lifestyle. There you go. Are you guys happy we interact with locals? We're not awkward at all, I promise. We're no. really good at socializing. No, we're, we're fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, sorry, I thought we were doing a high five. We're trying to find a good uh, Kerala restaurant to eat at for you guys to end this video. 
We were looking for a seafood restaurant, we just cannot find it. And uh, now we found another one on the map that's highly rated, so we're gonna go check that one out. See what type of Kerala specialties we can get. Yum. The temperature outside is actually pretty nice right now. It's a little humid, but nice. Oh, they're playing cricket over there or something? I'm enjoying a local cricket game. Actually, they're not. The ball isn't bouncing. They're like, play it looked like they were playing baseball because they were pitching it off the ground. All right, hopefully we gloves. can find this place. They're playing baseball? I think so, or softball. Maybe right in here. Oh, it's very, very full. So we ended up at a chai restaurant, and then they have chaya, which is, I guess, with milk in it. So we're getting some Indian milk tea, basically. Uh -huh. I'm getting ginger, which is like one of the first things he mentioned. So I was like, I guess that's one of the popular ones. And I went with cashew caramel, which is at the top of the chaya list. So which one's it gonna be? We will see. I'm very interested to see what this is gonna taste like. It seems like it'll be 15 per. This is very cheap. Let's try it. Let's chai it. Let's chai a tea. <laughs> Let's chai it. Can I try this? It's... Yeah. Thank you. I'll do uh, samosa, please. Chicken. Chicken, yeah, sure. Yeah, it's good, thank you. Thank you. Oh, you got the array. It feels like it's so hot. The glass is still so warm. It kind of looks like a cheesecake. I'm trying it. Oh, wow. Alright, thank you. That's interesting. It's like, um, what have we had before where it's like, it kind of looks like a cheesecake, but then just kind of falls apart. It's almost like a whipped, like a whipped uh, but solid thing. I've had something similar to this. It's pretty good. It's like a sort of eggy as I think to it. That's good. I'm so scared to eat that. Go ahead, eat your samosa, sir. Oh, what do you mean? I'm going to down this thing. Oh my right. gosh. <laughs> Corner, entering the mouth. You just stab yourself in the chin, sir. Mm. That is delicious. There's salt. It's like very oily inside and like onion meat. There's a lot of onion in there. A thousand other spices that I could not name you or tell you what they are, oh. but they come together and it's amazing. Nice and crispy on the outside. Mm. Mm. What a snack. It's getting there. I don't, the glass is probably just going to be so hot for a long time. But when I got when I got close to my lips, I could feel that was gonna burn me. The ginger chaya. It smells so hot still. Oh my gosh, it smells so spicy. You know, I was questioning whether ginger would be like too much or if it would be nice. Because ginger is kind of one of those things where you sometimes you get it, you're like, oh, that's nice. And sometimes you're like, oh, it's too gingery. But this is pretty good and it's super hot. It's, my tongue is like half fried right now. Half the time I try ginger ale, I'm like, oh, this is too gingery. It's good. I like it. It's just so hot. It's unbelievably hot. My tongue has, like, has that weird burn feeling, but it didn't go all the way. Uh, Will Smith would be loving this right now. Oh, that is hot. Well, it's interesting, yeah. Ginger, I like ginger ale. I like ginger cookies, but like... What about ginger people? No. They have no soul? No, no soul. But like sometimes I've had like ginger and like cooking or like it's like a like some sort of like Chinese dish or something and there's like big ginger chunks and you actually get one of those, it's awful. That's about it. That's pretty take good tasting. My tongue hurts a bit. Mine does too because it's mostly spicy. That's why I got sweet. <laughs> it's not hot anymore. And it's really, the ginger really goes in the back of your throat. But it feels, what does ginger do? What's like the health benefits of I ginger? I think it does something when you're sick. I'm not gonna be sick now. Only gonna be sick of the heat. <laughs> not, it's actually pretty nice out now. It's not hot anymore. Now we got the cashew caramel. Caramel, it's caramel. Is it hot 
hotter than you expected. I saw a little ting in your jaw. It is, yeah. I still have the spice in my mouth from the oh. samosa, so it kind of all combined for that experience. But the sweetness in there, it's got it's still that sort of bitterness from the tea, but the sweetness really takes over when you first get it. Very delicious. Well, that was Chaya. It was pretty good. I, I, I Once it cooled down, it was a much more enjoyable experience, <laughs> and then it was devoured immediately. We've never had Indian tea before. We got some fruit teas last time we were here, but we weren't really tea people. We've never, we never had tea last time we were in India. Now we've lived in Asia for so long that tea is very common for us. In the U.S., especially where we're from, tea isn't common at all. There's sweet tea like down south that's very famous, but... Sweet tea? Not not where we're from at all. We're in the north. The only thing you can get is like a good old brisk at a gas station. Yeah, Minnesota has like the brisk or an Arnold Palmer, which is tea mixed with things. Yeah, so that one was pretty delicious. And that's where we're going to leave you guys here today for our first impressions of Kerala and Kochi. That was a nice day. We got from way the heck over in the airport, downtown. Got a bunch of food, met some very friendly people, and it seems like it's gonna be an awesome city. The actual area of the city is way bigger than we expected, so we're probably gonna spend a few more days than we anticipated. If you watched our flying video, uh, we're already changing the plan, <laughs> so that's great. But I'm happy to change the plan because it seems like we'll have a lot of fun here. Last time we were in India, we spent a really long time in each city, which is definitely the best way to actually experience a city and actually be able to like uh, try a lot of the popular restaurants because we're only here for a few days, so we're gonna have to go and you know eat all the local cuisines and stuff like that. We're not gonna be able to try like the trendy cafe here and stuff like that. So. It gives us an opportunity that if you guys really enjoy the series that we can always come back to Kochi. Oh yeah, it seems like there's plenty to do. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. We will see you in the next one. Where are you, where are you going, sir? This is not my water. <laughs> I'm hiding. He's gone.